Welcome back to another episode of Fishing Florida. So we just finished pouring. It was raining really hard. And yeah, guys, the weather right now is perfect to go fishing. The bike should be fire. Hopefully, we'll see. Today, guys, I brought my mystery tackle box. Just got this. It's for the month of June. And yeah, guys, I'm really excited. Let's just get into the box and see what we got this month. Guys, let's look at what's in this month's mystery tackle box. I already see some really good stuff. But yeah, if I didn't if I didn't mention this already, this is the box I got for the month of June. So here we go. First up, I see this Lucky Craft Crankbait. I love the paint shop. Looks really sick. All right, so next thing we got in the box are these B8 Lab SQ Worms. These are just like Senkos. Those will be pretty easy to knock off. Then we have these sticky, these stickies offset worm hooks. So yeah, I'll use those with the Senkos. That would be pretty easy to knock off. We got these, we got these weight stops. Next lure in the box is this Max Lure Square Bill. Looks like a jerk bait, but we'll, we'll test the action. But yeah, that looks pretty cool. Then we got these Rage Tails. These look sick. Those will be really easy. All these Rage Tails, all the Rage Tail baits have some insane action. So yeah, really looking forward to that. And then the thing I'm most excited about is this last bait. This is a buzz bait. Looks absolutely insane. So what I'm gonna do, I'm gonna tie up this buzz bait. I'm just gonna, I'm gonna fish this for a while. This looks absolutely insane and it just rained. So this should work really good. All right guys, so I got this buzz bait tied up and the cool thing about this is this spiral is gonna stop this when you're casting. So what that's gonna allow you to do is to get farther casts. And then once it's in the water, you're still gonna be able to get good action with this buzz bait. But yeah, action on this is awesome. God, oh my God. He crushed it. He is trying to destroy it. Dang guys, that was a nice snake head. He tried to destroy it. Yeah, he tried to destroy my buzz bait. Oh, yo, he's going through. Guys, this snakehead wants the buzz bait. Oh, he got pissed at that, dude. There he is. No, he missed. Oh my gosh, guys, big snakehead. There he is. Got him. Got him, guys. On the buzz bait. Oh my god. Big fish. Big fish. Oh my god, dude. That's a good fish. Guys, big snakehead. Oh my gosh. Dude, he popped up. He popped. That was huge. At least we touched him. That was a good fish. If I had to estimate, I'd say that was around an eight pounder. Oh, snakehead, dude. Good fish. He ate it. Come on. Oh, he freaking missed it. Man, guys, this is tough. There's so many giant fish. A buzz bait is just not the move. If I had a frog, we'd be tearing these things up. Guys, I had probably like 20 bites on this of huge snakehead. They would all follow it up and then they wouldn't commit. It was insane. But yeah, it's been, it's been tough. I'm gonna switch from this buzz bait. I'm gonna probably go to a Senko and I'll use those hooks that I got. All right guys, we just switched up spots. There's a turtle right there. But um, I'll take a couple more casts with the buzz bait, even though I hate this thing right now. And then, yeah. I'm gonna switch to that stick bait I saw next. Look at this dude, look at him. Uh, I got him, I got him, I got him guys. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Guys, literally just hand noodled this big turtle. Look at that. Look how cool this thing is. Look at his face. Hey buddy. Dude, the colors on this thing are crazy. That is such a cool turtle. Look at his eye. Such a pretty turtle. 
All right, buddy, you're going back. Let's see if he wants to run back. You're free. Go, buddy. Yeah, man, go. All right, guys, so the buzz bait just defeated me. Had one fish on it, but yeah, next. Put that there for now. Next, we are going to tie on these stickies, four rod offset worm hooks. Um, and we're going to use these stick baits with them. So yeah. All right guys, so here's the rig. We got a bullet weight. We got one of these stickies offset worm hooks, four rod. And then here is the stick bait that we're using. It's just this, almost like a Senko. And then it has this little pattern on the top that looks pretty cool. But yeah, this should work really good here. We'll get, we should be able to knock this out right away. And yeah, let's get, let's get to fishing. All right guys, rigged up. Let's take a cast out there. Oh yeah, this is gonna work good guys. We should knock this off within the first few casts. That's a good one. Look at, guys, look at this turtle. He's just following me around. Guys, this turtle is literally following me. Look at him, you guys see him? He's been following me this whole way. We started way over there. Got him, that was sick. Dude, nice job. Good job seeing that. Dude, that was sick though. I was watching him and I saw his mouth open and I'm like, I'm pretty sure he has it. Finally, I held the snake head today. I had so many bites from these guys on the buzz bait and it took a Senko to get him. That's a little guy. There's one. Oh my gosh, he's going crazy. Yeah, first bass of the day. He's pretty, pretty small though. See, bud. Guys, he's actually following me. Buddy, you gotta go live your own life. Shoot, get out of here. He's just, he's just, uh, no, wrong, wrong way. That, that way. Oh, okay. I guys caught two fish so far on these B8 lab square worms these have the weirdest name but yeah sticky hooks still doing good we're gonna put another one on and yeah now's probably a good time to mention if you guys want ten dollars off your first mtb box that makes it only five dollars if you guys want a box for only five dollars use this code popping up right on these worms and yeah oh got him no way, did you see that? I was reeling it on top water. Oh, it's a bass. Dude, I thought it was a snakehead. Guys, bass blew up on it on top. Whoa, he didn't blow up. I saw him waking on my Senko. I let it sink and he just destroyed it. Third bass of the day, little guy. Oh my gosh, good fish, good fish. He was so shallow. I think it's a bass. Oh my gosh, he's digging. Dude, I thought it was so much bigger. He was, guys, he was so shallow. He just destroyed that fat fish. Let's see, bud. I am back. It's actually about a week later. But yeah, today I'm just gonna use the baits I got in my MTB box and I'm gonna try to catch a ton of fish. Hopefully we can make that happen. But let's just get right into the fishing. All right guys, we got the MTB box again. We're gonna try to finish off these baits. Um, I'm gonna go with these rage tails. These look sick so far. Let's see, we'll see their action. But yeah, look at that. Pull those apart, looks really good. All right guys, this is the rig. Looks pretty sick. Got this on a PC Fun Phantom Reel and the Serpent Rod. This combo is sick. But yeah, I'm gonna throw this around for a little bit and then I'll probably switch to that crankbait. There's one, I got one. That's a good one. Guys, first fish of the day, that's a pretty decent one. Wow, he fought hard. Boom, 
on the rage tail. Oh wow, he choked it. All right guys, solid first bass of the day. Let's get a quick release. He absolutely choked the rage tail. See you bud. Here's one, I think. Nope, that was a rock. Oh, he is. Got him. Another decent fish. Boom. Oh, just <laughs> dropped the rod. Nice. Guys, these fish love the rage tail. Look at that. All right, guys, another solid bass. Crushed the rage tail. He choked it. See you, bud. Oh, okay. See you, bud. There's one. Snap. Wow. All right guys, just switched to the crankbait I got in the MTB box. This should definitely get some fish. There's one. Crush the crankbait, good fish. Good fish. Oh my god. Giant, giant. Let's go, guys. That is a pig. He absolutely crushed the crankbait. That is a solid fish. All right, guys, solid bass. Really good fish. Crushed the crankbait and fought like crazy. That's a nice one. Let's get a release. All right, guys, solid fish. Look at that. See you, buddy. There he goes. Very next cast, no way. Oh wow, he's fighting hard. Not that big, but he freaking demolished it. Sorry for the wind noise, but very next cast. That is a solid fish. He fell like crazy too. Oh wow, there he goes. Just for fun, I tied on a whopper plopper. I'm gonna throw this around for about half an hour and then I have to head out of here. So hopefully we can get some bass, snakehead, and whatever else wants to eat this whopper plopper. Oh my god, crushed, second cast, good fish, good bass, no way. Literally second cast with the Whopper Plopper, that's a good bass, boom. Okay, right, solid bass, probably around a two pounder, crushed the Whopper Plopper, he like jumped over it. See you bud. Oh, wow. Guys, a bug landed on my hand. I looked at it, and then I got blown up right at the bank. Oh, got him, got him. Good snakehead on the whopper plopper. Boom, crushed it. It was sick. Oh, okay, okay, relax, relax. Oh my god, wow. It was insane, <laughs> what? He just like walked right in the water. Wow, okay. Well, that was a good, probably four pound snakehead on the Whopper Plopper, he crushed it. Oh, there we go, good boy, good one. Oh wow, good bass. He's running. Jeez, that's a good fish. Don't come off. Boom. Another good bass on the Whopper Plopper. He absolutely exploded on it. Awesome fish. Probably around a two and a half. That was so sick. See you, buddy. Oh wow, spook something big. There you, oh, he missed it. She got him, got him. Good fish. What is that? Oh my God, it's a big bass. Jeez. 
that is a good fish. Another three, three and a half. That is a good fish. Really nice bass. See, buddy. And there he goes. All right, guys, that is gonna do it for the video. Hope you guys enjoyed. I caught a lot of fish and some really good fish with the mystery tackle box. If you guys want $10 off your first MTV box, use the code popping up right here. That's pretty much it. Thanks for watching. Hope you guys enjoyed. And I'll catch you next time on the next episode of Fishing Forum.